Today I'm going to be going over deploying a front running bot on PancakeSwap with the wrapped BNB pair. Okay, so if you just follow the description of the video as far as downloading MetaMask and also funding it, make sure that it's connected to the Binance Smart Chain and uh, that's about halfway there. Uh, then you just follow over to Remix, which is where the window I'm started right now remix.ethereum.org. Uh, this is where we're gonna be building our contract. So you can pause this video if you need time. Uh, right now I'm gonna go into contracts. Uh, under contracts, I'm gonna create a new contract, which is with this new file, create new file icon on the top left. Uh, we're gonna title this contract front run bot. And uh, let's see. And uh, we're going to copy the contract information that I put in the description. Couple items to look at here is the lines 50 and 51. Uh, if you follow those addresses on that, that's the input address for the wrapped BNB token which I should have up here. Yeah. So this is that address. Uh, it's the token tracker for rat BNB because that's what we're going to be working against as well as also the pancake router for a uh, pancake swap version two, uh, which all that information is preloaded through a function manager that routes back to a, um, a Node.js file which was built with a VS code. So this can be run and injected with web three, which how we'll get there to deploying the contract is we go, this was built with Pragma Solidity 6.6, which is the version of Remix that this was compiled in. So we go to version 6.6, uh, Solidity, and that's it. Let me go compile front run bot. There we go. It compiled. Uh, so we're going to deploy this to our wallet. Make sure oop, I have other deployed contracts out there. Let me clear that one out. I'll just, okay. So we're going to do injected web three. Uh, make sure that your wallet is connected to Remix. Uh, so how you can make sure that it's connected to Remix is this should show connected, which is not. So let me connect. All right, so it says that I am connected now. So this little light should turn green. That shows that you're connected. And now it should let us deploy this. And there we go. So gas, that should be fine. I can confirm that. All right. So we should get a transaction confirmation here, right there at the bottom. And now we have our deployment utility right here which uh, once you drop down, will give you some information like action, token name, token symbol. Uh, right now, we're just going to copy that contract to make sure that it shows up in the BSC smart chain. BSC scan. I copy that, paste it in BSC scan. We can see that it's an address there now. Uh, so the next step in this process is just finding your contract, uh, which is simple enough. Let's go to your wallet. Uh, let's click on MetaMask. See, it took a little bit of gas. I just started with one BNB and now we're down to um, basically mm, less than $2. 
Uh, so we're just going to send some funds to that contract that we just created. Make sure I got the right address in there. Sake of this video, I'm just going to do 0.2 BNB. Might as well make it uh, 0.4, a little bit extra sometimes helps. So that way we can make sure that we make sure that we make an impact on the liquidity once we interact with a a contract that just add liquidity within pancake swap so let's give it a moment there we go so the transactions confirmed so it was sent to the contract uh next thing that we do after it's sent to the contract we'll just go over here and press the action button um the action button and then uh engages all the constructors that i built in as far as engaging the pancake router uh it automatically buys and sells for you so how that works is it will transact the liquidity as soon as it's added to a token. Then it gives it generally, let me see, uh, put it in with this variable that it'd be just one minute before the action sells. So you basically just do an automated buy sales within one minute. So it'll find the liquidity, buy into that project so that way it will front run all the retail uh investors that come in so you'll only be competing with other bots on the mempool it will automatically sell within a minute and then uh from there it will take 90 percent will automatically trans back to your wallet the remaining 10 percent will stay within the front running protocol and that 10% will automatically keep sniffing for liquidity. Uh, front run, transact the profit back to your wallet. I've had really good luck with this uh, last few weeks. I've made several hundred BNB, which I can show the uh, transaction reports on BSC scan to corroborate that. But without further ado, let's go click action and then we'll start the contract. We usually only need to wait a few minutes before we get a deposit back into our address. So let me click this. It's going to ask for another signature. So we confirm a little bit extra gas fee. Let's just wait so that way we can have our contract look for liquidity within pancake swap. And once it finds it, it will automatically transact. Generally, this takes about a minute. There's new contracts with added liquidity pretty much every minute of the day. Because everyone's coming out with their new little rug pool trash coin. But at least if we can get ahead of that, uh, we can make a little bit of profit as soon as they drop the liquidity because we're buying out on the same block of the liquidity. So there's, you know, anyone who's transacting directly through pancake swap, we're going to be in front of them. All right, let me take a look. I can almost guarantee you that I got something back by now. And there we go. Yeah. It's already around 15 X. Uh, so the longer we wait, that will automatically uh, reinvest the 10% and it transfers back to 90%. So the actual profit was a little higher than that. There's still 10% in that front running pool that's still looking for liquidity. Uh, you can run this cycle multiple times a day. Uh, you can have upwards of a thousand BNB day if you use a larger amount than I started with. Yeah. <laughs>